Hey guys, I'm Igor from Noblex Solutions and today we're going to unbox the brand new and hugely anticipated Nandrobot LS7 Plus. Here's our plan for the next videos on this channel. First and foremost, we will test its max speed. After that, we will test its range and of course, uh, we will do the full review on the top of that. We promise that you will enjoy our next video, so make sure to smash the subscribe button and the notification bell. I can't wait to take it out of the box, so let's do it. Damn, it looks massive. Just look at the size of this deck. It's probably 10 times bigger than on those cheap rental scooters and the stem is super beefy. And also it has huge 11 inch off-road tires. Really, really impressive. They put all the extras in this cool box. So let's take a look inside. So here is the manual. We also found a pump in this box. Uh, remote control for the lights, a charger, two bolts for the steering damper, here is the multi-tool and uh, valve extender and the steering damper with the uh, Nandrobot logo. Looks really cool. We're going to install the handlebars now. We are super excited about testing this bad boy and uh, actually looking at this scooter I suppose the riding experience will be super smooth. Who is it for you might wonder? Well, definitely not for beginners. Uh, I would say it's for huge electric scooter enthusiasts or uh, experienced riders. This machine is no joke. The damper installation is super easy. You just need those two hex screws. You put one here and one here. And actually the steering damper is adjustable. Really heavy damping. So the steering damper installation is complete. That was super easy, very straightforward. Again, the scooter looks huge, it's massive. What I like about it uh, is actually this new display. It's positioned in the middle of the handlebar so you don't have to turn right during your rides to check your speed. That's a huge advantage in my opinion. So check this out guys, it's on turbo mode, dual drive and third gear. <laughs> Let's test the lights now. Well, what I like about these lights is that you can easily change the colors and modes using remote control. Really cool and useful feature, especially for riding in low light conditions. That's it for now. The first impressions of the new Nandrobot LS7 Plus are super good and I can't wait to ride this beast. That's probably exactly what I'm going to do after finishing this video. Thanks for watching guys, don't forget to subscribe and see you in our next videos.